What's up? This your man Steph, and welcome to Black. So this is one of those text novel story games. I think I don't know. I mean, yeah, I think it is, but it looks pretty fucking good, yo. It looks like a fucking like scary game. It might be a scary game. I don't know, but I don't know which one of these I press. Probably high. Yep. So why'd you look at me? Don't look at no. Who are you? Uh, who are you? Uh, I'm going to say hi. Are you going to kill me? Hi. Uh, who are you? Who are you? You know what? I'm not even going to be disrespectful because clearly I'm in his area. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm, oh, I can actually enter my name. I'm going to tell him my name. I'm Stefan. No, nah, let's not tell him my whole name. I'm Steph. I like this, man. What is a step? <laughs> I'm not, uh, it's a man. No one. A man. I am a man. <laughs> On, on certain days, <laughs> which is not one of those days today. What the fuck is he, man? What is a step? Where am I? Where is this place? Do you have, you really don't have much to say, do you? Here. Where is here? So what is this game about? You know? They say that I, like at the bottom, they say I can go closer or I can keep my distance. You don't talk much, do you? Oh, no. You have a nice smell. Uh, I'm just going to stay the fuck away from you. Uh, yeah, I, I really, yeah, we, we need to get up out of here. Let's bounce. Let's go. No, stay. Come. No. Oh, I said come. What do you want from me? Oh well, he's gonna cook us, cut us. No, he's gonna he's gonna cook us, cut us up, eat us, and Oh no, I'm not hungry. But I feel like every time I say I, I reject or I resist something that he's trying to offer me. I find it very disrespectful. So, no, I'm still not hungry, though. Eat. No. Eat. No. Why not? Okay. I could be straight up with this fool. Or I could fuck around and just explain to him and in 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 sections in a in a nice little explanatory explanatory essay you know what i'm saying as to why i don't want to eat that shit i'm gonna go ahead and just explain i don't want to insult anybody because you can't force people to eat if they don't want to why because it's not am i really lecturing a goddamn wild animal man about why he shouldn't force people to do stuff is this actually going to have an effect on this fool i don't know he tosses the meat to you anyway ask what it is cook it leave it there eat it raw ask what it is what is it i mean i assumed that it was a heart but you know what kind of meat is this he doesn't even know he just cut it out of some meat I'm just going to leave it there. Well, I mean, I could cook it. I mean, I don't know where I am. Maybe I'm hungry. You know what I'm saying? Has he ever had cooked food? I'm going to cook it. Do you mind if I cook it? He doesn't care. Then I'll start a fire, all right? Okay. Don't attack me if I if you've never, if you've never seen fire before. The smell is funny, but I have to say, 
It's not bad. Oh, I keep, like, I wish they would put my name right by the dialogue, you know what I'm saying? Or put his, like, put a, a name for him right by the dialogue because I don't know who's talking. How about I offer it to him? Do you want to try it? Come on, come on, here, take a piece. It's good. I mean, I wouldn't know. I didn't, I didn't eat any. I stick the cooked meat on it. You better hope he likes it. Oh, no. Oh, no, he can only eat raw meat. Uh, I'm going to ask him, is he okay? I don't want to call him a thing or a creature. Let's just stay silent. How about we just stay silent? How about we just shut up? Ah, I could run away. This could be my chance to run away. I mean, like, why would you ask him, is he dead? He's going to assume that you tried to kill him. Then he's going to kill you. I'm running away. Oh, well, damn. Right behind us. Raw, much, much better. Yep. Got my ass killed. So, yeah, this game has multiple endings, if you guys didn't know already. Ending 8 of 9, Vegan Nightmare. Okay. I mean, I don't see how any of that was vegan in any way. So, I'm going to go ahead and try again, man. This game is actually cool. I doubt I'm going to get all the endings, even though I'm only 7 minutes in. But, you know, you never know. Who are you? All right. Now, I guess I'll say I'm a man. I'm going to say I'm a man. I'm a man. What is a man? Am I dead? Why not? No, but you will be. You seem very alive to me. How the hell did we get here? That's that's what I want to know. How the hell did we just so happen to get in a in a jungle? You know what I'm saying? Well, it's a lot of metal all around, man. So I'm going to assume that this is probably like in the future. You know what I'm saying? It has to be probably in the like near future, not distant. I really should go. No, stay. Come. Well, I mean, telling him no isn't going to do shit. He's just going to force us. I'm going to just go with him. Why the fuck not? What do you want from me? What the hell is that? It looks like a damn heart, yo. Eat. No. I'm still saying no. I'm not eating that damn shit, man. No. Eat. No. I will not. I'm going to leave it there. Because if I cook it, I mean, I could eat it if I cook it, but yeah, I'm just going to leave it there. You leave it there, not daring to pick it up. The soil soaks up the blood, turning purple around it. That is disgusting as all hell. Unintelligible. What did you say? I'm going to kill you right now. Nothing. Okay, this silence is eerie, but the creature seems to be willing to talk to me to a certain degree. Maybe I should try to start a conversation. Be kind. You don't want to kind of be aggressive to something that could probably kill you in like the matter of seconds. This is a really nice place you have. <laughs> a bit dark and gray and, you know, a bit cold, but uh, I can look past that. Nice, I guess. <laughs> he's not saying shit. Have you been living here for long? I'm going to say that he's been living here his whole life, which is why he's not really a people's person. Where are you from? That's not what I asked. Where are you from? I don't know. Shit, I'm going to be evasive. I don't fucking know. I don't know. Somewhere you wouldn't know. Try me. Soon it'll get dark and cold. And when that time comes, I'll strike. Aren't you cold? I 
I'm gonna start a fire since I did that before. I'm starting a fire, all right? I hope she doesn't hear, well, he, since it's, I chose the character, the character's gender. You're ugly. Oh! So you wanna take it there, huh? Oh! You know what, I'm not even gonna crack jokes. I'm not gonna crack jokes. I can't crack jokes because he's gonna murder me, you know? Wow, so out of the blue. <laughs> he called me ugly, yo. Like, what the hell? I'm not ugly, am I? I don't think I'm ugly. Oh! Have you seen yourself? Clearly not. No mirrors out here, man. And we haven't seen them. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna be honest. If somebody called me ugly, I'm gonna just say thanks, man. Cause I've had people call me ugly. Even a per a little kid or something called me ugly on game joke on the comment section. They told me I was ugly. They were like, "No offense, but you're ugly." I'm like, "Thanks, young one." You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Nah, but I'll be like, "Have you seen yourself?" Oh, wait. Neither have I. That's what I'm saying. You've never seen him. But not scary. There are scarier things out there. Like you. He's sharpening his spear. More scratching. Yep, he's gonna stab us in a minute. Is he? Yeah, he is. Oh yeah, he is. Sharpening his spear? Yeah, he is. Yeah, he's, he's hungry. Why didn't he just eat the meat? Sleep so that I can kill you. Creature's gone. I mean, let's just assume that if I if I run away, I'm able to get away. To what extent though? Is that gonna be an ending, or am I gonna come across some other people like him, or you know, am I just gonna die? Cause I, I I assume that if I sleep, I'm gonna die, man. You know, I don't just wanna. I'm gonna run again. Get out of there. And I'm dead. So I told you, sleep. So he wasn't asleep. He was just sitting there waiting for me to sleep. God damn it. Ah, this shit sucks, man. Well, for a night, sweet dreams. So I could have slept. But what would that have brought on me? I don't know, but I'm going to figure it out. You know, I'm actually going to say get away from me. Am I that scary? Good. Uh. Oh, wow, that's it? Wow, this fucker is hardcore, man. Jesus. What if I say I'm a woman now? Will he try and mate with me? Oh, I wonder if that I wonder if that is a thing, man. I wonder if like gender matters in this game. What if he's gonna be like, you're pretty? You know, like when I when when he called me ugly because I guess I was a man? That's a bunch of bullshit, you damn gender biased fucker. This is gonna be my last ending. But I'm gonna go ahead and see what it what it's like to eat the, the meat raw. You know what I'm saying? Why not? Crunching meaty dripping noises. Probably gonna throw up. That's the only thing I can really think of, especially if that was fresh. Okay, this silence is eerie. Wow, you just ate it? No, no gag, no throwing up. That was raw meat, man, from somebody raw and and, and fresh. Fresh out the man, just fresh, man. Fresh out of the box, yo. I'm actually gonna tell him the truth. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't remember. Something's wrong with my memory. Good, good. I have a clueless idiot who's gonna get eaten. The last thing I recall is waking up amidst the rubble. So, if you guys know Forrest, you guys know that game that Mark played with Jack. Uh, you, you were in a plane crash and you, you fell and then you had to survive and shit. What if that's like this? What if you, what, what if we were on a plane and we crashed you know, like with other survivors, and sh well, they died too. You know, they died, and we all we were the only one who survived. And they fucked around, and you know, well, our character lost their memory or his memory. You know, whatever, whatever you choose. They lost their, they lost their memory, and we woke up. 
with that fucker just standing there around the, 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 the metal and stuff like that. That's probably what that was, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it's not in the future. It's not like a bunch of metal buildings and shit. He just so happened to come across the... He was trying to scavenge, man. That's pretty much what he was doing, and he found us. Where the fuck did you go? I'm gonna start a fire again, though. I'm always gonna start a fire, man. You gotta start a fire. If you don't start a fire, you're gonna freeze your ass off. Then he's just gonna eat you again. I mean, I'd rather... You're ugly. Wow. So he, he just finds everybody to be ugly, huh? No matter how attract... But you know what? That's interesting, though, because you could be... You could be one attractive-ass person. Whether you're male or female, you know what I'm saying? And that's just how his mentality works. You know what I'm saying? He his kind isn't ugly to him. You know what I'm saying? Which is like, you know how like monster movies where a monster sees a human and they're like, oh, it's so hideous. Get it away from me. You know what I'm saying? Like they're not used to seeing a human, even though a human can be as attractive to another human, but to a monster or something like that, they're ugly. It's 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 a weird way of thinking, man. But that's just, you know, it's different lifestyles, different nature, you know what I'm saying? So you can't really get upset when they call a an attractive person ugly. And when we call an ugly person unattractive, you know what I'm saying? It's just it's just preference, you know what I'm saying? Ah, uh, thanks, I guess. I don't know, but not scary. There's scarier things out there. Yep, here we go. He's gonna tell us to sleep. And then we're gonna die. All right, let's go ahead and sleep. Go ahead and sleep and die in our sleep. The dark came really fast. Hell yeah, it was like it was as if it was orchestrated. You know what I'm saying? Like it was just like we're in theater, you know. But there's no way I'm sleeping. He's probably waiting in the shadow for me to lower my guard and then what? Then what? Kill me? I mean, either way, it was you were gonna die. Eat me? I need to find him. Better stay here. Oh, man. Damn. Why the hell would you enter? You know? But then again, why would you stay? I'm liking this game, man. I'm gonna... Uh, if we enter and we get away from this fire, that's just cause, that's gonna call for him to kill us even more. Like, faster, because we'll be in his domain. You know what I'm saying? Jesus, this reminds me of so many movies. Like, also that, that uh, what's that movie where those women went in the cave? They went in the cave, and there were, like, those creatures that lived in the caves and shit like that, and they could see, they were nocturnal, you know what I'm saying? And the women, they were, like, cave divers and shit. I forgot what that shit was called. But anyway, it reminds me of this. I'm going to stay here, because I'm not dying like that. Yes, yeah, the safest choice. You're damn right. I mean, unless we had a torch. If we had a torch, it wouldn't be that bad. No sense risking adventuring inside that dark cave. <laughs> I'll stay here by the fire and be vigilant. If he tries anything, I can still defend myself with it. How, what, are you gonna blow it at him? You know, like, what the fuck, man? Jesus. The hell? What's going on? What was that? Oh, no. The fire. Oh, you're dead, man. What the hell is all that damn shit? I grip one of the logs and start to wave it. Really? You got a log? You couldn't light that bitch on fire? Like, come on, man. Show yourself. No, don't do that, because there's a jump scare. I'm going to cry. You, you coward. What do you want from me? He's in my right ear. A woman is good. Very, very good. He's gone. No, he's not. He's there. He's still there. What the? F that's that's it. I need to find him. The coals are still hot after blowing on him. The fire awakens once again. Light that log on fire. Your hands are shaking a little as you take up a log. Yes. Yes. That's my girl. Girls are smart as hell. Women out there, female, little girls, whatever. I don't give a fuck. You guys are smart, man. I feel tense like a live wire. My insides are twisting. It's so dark. Man, I'm liking this game, yo. Uh-oh, he's got blood on him. You've got red on you. You guys remember that? Uh, Sean is dead. Anybody? You won't scare me. You hear me? This ends now. What if we actually kick his ass? 
Holy shit, what if she actually kicks his ass? There's a passage. What if we kick his ass, man? Oh, wow. We came to a pool of acid. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a lake? At least I know I don't. I won't die of thirst if I don't die of something else. I look around, but the darkness is way too thick. Seems there's nothing here. I turn around, ready to enter the passage again, when suddenly, da 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 da, there are more of them, you know. I see him on the ground, sleeping, or pretending to. I can hardly suppress the wretch. He's monstrous. It's the ugliest, most horrendous thing I've ever seen in my life. I would love to see him carefully, ever so carefully. I take his spear. Now armed, I know what I must do. Ooh. Now, see, mind you, listen. Peep this out. Now, if we don't kill him, maybe there's a slight chance he might let us go. But we'll have his weapon, so he can't really do shit. Now, if we do kill him, there's probably going to be more of them. You know what I'm saying? Or he's going to, like, he's got fast reflexes and he's going to kill us. So, I might not kill him, you know? And it took me a while to get to this point. So this is going to be my final decision. So place your bets. What the hell should I do? Should I flip a coin? I really, I really, 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 I truly feel like there's going to be more of them if I kill him. You know? Or he's just going to kill us. So I'm not going to kill him. I look at him in the dark. He sleeps peacefully with a smile. Somewhat creepy, but he almost seems content. As ugly as this creature may be, he looks like a child. I hesitate and he stirs in his sleep. The light from the torch wakes him. What happened? He immediately widens his eyes and jumps back into the darkness, hissing. He's patting the ground frantically, searching for his spear. Don't even think about that. I have your weapon. I grip the spear tighter, my heart exploding in my chest. Now give me a good reason not to kill you. Then he runs away. Oh, he lunges at me. I brace for impact. But instead, he runs past me into the tunnel. That's weird. That's that's very weird, man. The tunnel leads me back to the fireplace. Wary, I scan my surroundings in search of him, ready to attack. I don't know what you were trying to do before, but I'm not scared of you. Understand? Come out. Look, I know you want to eat me. But it doesn't have to be that way. We don't have to be enemies. If you promise you won't attack me again, I'm willing to forget about it. We can start over. I mean, I didn't kill him after all. And I didn't try to. So he can't say I'm a threat. Because I thought about him. All lives matter, right? 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 We can help each other. As a sign of my good intentions, I let the spear fall to the ground. It's risky, but it's the only way. You done fucked up, man. You shouldn't have dropped it. What's your answer? I, my tummy aches. I've never eaten a woman before. So maybe if I eat you, my belly won't hurt anymore. You don't need to eat me to get better. On the contrary, it will get you even sicker. No, I tried everything else. I always puke. You're the only thing left to try. What are you, a fucking zombie? What the fuck? And that's why you're sick. You probably have some kind of indigestion or stomach virus. I mean, I'm not going to say that he's far off from human. You know what I'm saying? I mean, he's not the average human. He's clearly got some some tendencies and, and, and physical, you know, traits that of a an, an animal. But he's still human. You know what I'm saying? So he can't still get a disease and shit like that. You know, so maybe that's all that raw meat probably has a very bad stomach virus or probably like a disease or something eating random things won't cure you you need medicine but how long have you been feeling like this a couple of days couldn't you find someone to help you i mean did you not see his approach to us that fucker tried to kill us well he did kill us twice there's no one to ask or maybe three times i forgot there's never that's just how much i die there's never been anyone here Never. Until. You.
I was thinking of eating you, it's true. But I didn't try to yet. What? Don't lie. I clearly saw you, and you just said there's no one else here. No one, yes. S only them. Them. Those things. Are there more? There's more, right? What things? They become your nightmares, your fears. I don't know how they do it, but they do. They can even get in here if you're not careful. Wait, are you trying to tell me that there are creatures here who enter your thoughts and materialize your fears? Ghosts, demons, all that shit. So it wasn't you who tried to kill me, and I'm just imagining it? Wherever there's white, they can't show you scary things. Have you not noticed that? I scoff, incredulous, incredulous. Incre Incredible! I don't know. All this situation seems too much absurd and dis discordant to me. Then why don't you let me go outside and let them kill me if you were so afraid of me? I wanted to know you first. Yeah, you know your prey before you kill your prey. I mean, hey, if, have you guys never killed anybody? Come on, man. And now that you know me, what's the verdict? You seem nice. I didn't kill you. Of course I'm nice. You could have let me know instead of being a jerk to me. I wasn't. Forcing me to follow you, not answering questions, telling me I smell nice. Is that rude? You said it like you wanted to cook me and eat me as dessert. I shouldn't probably give him ideas. But you do. I smell of sweat and dirt. That's good. See? He's backwards thinking, but it's his nature. Well, compared to them, him, I might as well smell like a flowery meadow. But am I believing this? Yeah. All right. Then what about that smell, that smile you gave me while sharpening your spear? My spear? I wasn't sharpening anything. So what's going on? I didn't read that. All right. Then what about that smile you gave me while sharpening your spear? Oh, I can like scroll my answers and stuff. All right. Then what about my spear? I wasn't sharpening anything. So what? Like, sit. He seems genuinely confused. So what's going on, man? Then what was that sound? He goes suddenly quiet. He seems hesitant, almost timid. He brings the closed fist to his chest. Then he looks at you quickly, lowering his gaze again. Something rolls and stops short in front of you. What's this? It's some kind of wrapping. I pick it up. Inside, there's some kind of black stone. They're afraid of this color. If you paint your face and clothes with it, they'll leave you alone. What is it, man? Then you want to eat me? As if that answer to that question is almost too much for him. He leaves before you can say something else. Is he gone for real this time? And leaves the spear behind. I'm left here alone. I examine the rock in my hand. It's some sort of charcoal that leaves a sticky black powder on my skin, turning it pitch black. I'm about to toss the wrapping aside when at the last moment I realize that it's a paper folded in two. Opening it, I find something unexpected. A drawing. Sketched on in a, child, in a clear child fashion are two figures holding hands. The creature and I. Oh, that's nice. I look at the drawing in my hands at the charcoal then outside. It's still dark, but soon the sun will rise. Oh, man, that's, that's crazy, man. I mean, he doesn't have his spear, so he can't kill me. But he, he sees us as friends, yo. You know, why would I kill him? I'm going to run. I'm, I'm gone, man. I'm out of there. I grab the spear resolu resolutely and head towards the first rays of light. Step sounds. Mommy. Oh, no! He was a child, man. He was a fucking child. He was a child and he just wanted a mother, man. I'm not sure about those scared creatures afraid of the color black, but I use the charcoal anyway. One can only be so careful, especially in my situation. Oh my god, man, that is... <laughs> I was on a ship, we crashed. So it was a ship, not a plane. I was on a ship, we crashed, and no one else except me seemed to have survived. Except that creature. But something tells me that he came here way before me. Maybe on another ship. But anyway, 
I don't know on what planet I am, nor if someone will ever come get me someday, someday eventually. But until then, I'll survive. And whatever this mysterious thing may be, I'll face them alone. Oh, so that was the first ending. Every man for himself. That's awesome, man. Wow. So clearly we're on another planet. We're not on Earth. And we were on a ship. I mean, I kind of called that the whole life. We crashed and everybody died and shit like that. But that was a child, man. I mean, they hinted at it. You know what I'm saying? But I didn't really believe it. I didn't really believe that it was a child. But man, he just wanted a mom. But they were like, it was weird because... There were like creatures, other creatures other than him. You know what I'm saying? That could like, I guess, feed on your fear of some scarecrow shit. You know what I'm saying? But he said that he didn't recall like trying to kill us and shit like that. So what was really going on? Were like, was that our fear? Like all of that shit that we were thinking about was just like those other creatures playing on our fear. So everything that happened was because of them and it was all an illusion. I don't know, man, but that shit was crazy. Man, I like this game. I thought I was like an hour in, but I'm only 30 minutes in. That game was awesome. Try it out. Try it out and get all the other endings if you want to, man. I, I highly encourage you guys to see what's up. Man, I have nothing more to say. Just play the game. Have fun with it. I, I expected like a scary game, but it wasn't. You know, I was expecting jump scares and stuff like that, but it wasn't. You know, it was more of just a like a a tense, suspenseful kind of like story. It wasn't it wasn't really anything scary, you know. But man, that was awesome. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys later. I'm out. <laughs>